guys, what's up? So it's been like six, maybe seven months since there's been any videos uploaded to this channel. Hopefully I'm the only one who noticed that, but um, sorry, but basically I have wanted to come back and film videos for so long, but I've been like debating on what I want to film or upload and things like that. And yeah, I've just been debating for a long time and I was finally like, okay, I just need to do this. So here I am here. Um, basically I got my tax return a little bit ago and I kind of went psycho. Um, this was just some of the boxes from today and I just got home from the mall. So I was like, I don't know if hauls are still a thing or what, but I asked my friend Paige, I was like, should I record a haul or is that like not a thing anymore? And she's like, no, do it. So here I am doing it. And like I said, I just got back from the mall and Mac was doing something like in the middle of our mall, they had this huge setup with like fake grass and flamingos. And there was like 30 makeup artists there. And my friend was actually one of the makeup artists. And I was like, hey, and she was like, let me do your makeup. So my makeup right now is insanely good compared to normal. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to embrace this and I'm going to film a video. And here I am. So yeah, uh, basically let's get started. So the first thing I guess I can tell you I got was this hat from PacSun and Aspen Ovard has this hat and she is my spirit animal and everything she buys I have to get. And so this hat is like always sold out and I saw it and I was like, should I get it? And I put it on and I was like, I'm a mom, I'm getting it. Next, I went to Victoria's Secret. Uh, they have a bunch of stuff on sale right now for Valentine's Day. And I got a few friends things for like their birthdays that are coming up. And one of the things was, if I can grab it, was buy one, get one free on the roller balls. So I got her one and then I was like, I'll use the second one because my, travel like rollerball actually exploded on my way to san antonio like when i was in the airplane it just exploded so i was like why not and pure seduction is like the best smelling scent ever so i got it and then i got this shirt and whenever victoria's secret has stuff in this green color i always am like i'll get it later and then it always sells out and i always hit myself and so I saw this and I was like, okay, I need to get this now because it's really cute and in Arizona, it's already 85, 90 degrees and it's February. So I can wear this now and yeah, basically it's really cute. I don't know, I bought it and I'm really excited to wear it. So yeah, the next thing I actually was sent a while ago, not a while ago, a while ago, I mean like a week and a half ago, but I just started using it because I was in Texas, but it's from Pure Adore and it's a shampoo and a conditioner and an argan oil. And as you can tell, since my last video, I've cut my hair, I'm trying to make it like really healthy. So I got these in the mail, like right before I left and I just started using them and I'm really excited because I heard argan oil stuff is really, really good on your hair. And so hopefully it makes my hair healthy because I kind of just wanted to start over because my hair was so dead. And then I went to Sephora or I ordered online from Sephora because there was a few things I wanted that they only had online and the main thing was this. Jaclyn Hill talks about this brush all the time and I used it for the first time this morning. I have no idea what it's called but it looks like this and it's so expensive so I hate myself for buying it but I've wanted it for so long so I was like all right tax return it'll be my splurge and so I got it and it actually worked so well this morning. It's so much easier than like an angled contour brush. So I'm really, really excited I got it because I really liked it this morning. And then the foundation I use, I ran out of it and online only they have this exclusive deal where you got the foundation and you got a beauty blender for 45. Like the foundation is normally 35. So for 10 more dollars, you got a beauty blender and mine is trash. Mine's like ripped and just disgusting. So I was like, I can't turn that down. And I was literally like, I used the last pump of my foundation today. So it came like this and I don't know for 10 more bucks and you get a beauty blender. Why not? So yeah. Then I got this. I actually have used this before and I tell all my friends this is the best brush cleanser you will ever use in your entire life. I have the spray ones. I've tried the MAC one. The solid is just insane. It makes my brushes that are black like back to white. Like the brush hairs are white and I use this and then they like they go back to their normal color which is crazy and it's disgusting how much like Oh, I keep saying like, I'm sorry. It's disgusting how much makeup actually comes off your brushes with this. So I highly, highly recommend this. And then the last thing I got from Sephora was 
this. This is a Sephora Los Cabos matte bronzer and I got this for the first time about a year ago when they were out of Hoola and this is about half the price of Hoola or NARS or any of that and it's pretty much a dupe for Hoola so I always just use this because it's I think it's like 18 instead of 28 or 30 what however much I don't know but this is literally the same thing but half the price so that is what I got from Sephora and then I got this in the mail today and I genuinely thought it was never gonna come because I ordered this literally on Black Friday and again it's because of Aspen Ovard and my mom got these for me for Christmas and they literally just came today so, and I ordered them Black Friday so about three months like I genuinely thought they weren't gonna come and there are these booties I have no idea what they're called like the boxes literally brown like there's nothing on it and they're like this burnt orange color and they have a tiny heel and they're so cute I don't know like I said Aspen Ovard posted a video that she got them and she had this really cute outfit wearing them so I bought the whole outfit but these finally came today and I'm so excited I don't have any heel booties or like boots this color and I think they're really cool because they're like a pop of color yet they're still not like super crazy but sadly like I said it's like 90 in Arizona so I don't know how much I'm gonna be able to wear these until next year so I don't know, but... So the last place I ordered from was Pepper Mayo, which is an Australian place. I don't know if they actually have stores. I don't think so. I think it's online, but I know it's from Australia. Like, all the prices are Australian and things like that. And basically, I have been on the hunt for these. And I just found that they were... I guess not the hunt, because you can find them in a lot of places. But they were, like, significantly cheaper on the Australian website. So they are the... Quay K, however you say it, depends on which YouTube video you're on. Australia X Amanda line, and they are the Muse Aviators. And I was debating for like an hour on which ones I was gonna get. They were sold out of the rose gold ones, and so it was between these and the orange ones. And I want them all. I saw M Megan Rosette post a video with them, and I was like, oh my gosh, those are perfect. And I'm tried getting the Ray-Ban reflectives like two years ago and they were just too small so and I've always been scared to try colored reflexive scents and I am so obsessed with these I've been sitting on my couch wearing them which is kind of embarrassing but it's fine if you can get your hands on a pair of the Amanda Muse not Ray-Bans aviators do it before they're sold out they've sold out twice before they are so cute and they're super these are on Pepper Mayo I believe they were 45 on like Quay or pack center and things like that they're gonna be a little more expensive I believe they're 60 but they're so cute they're worth it they're a lot cheaper than Ray-Bans anyways so. and then the last thing in this haul is this it's kind of pointless to show but uh if you guys are obsessed with Polaroids like I am this is definitely something you might want to look into they're just little photo albums for your Polaroids this is my third one because I take Polaroids all the time, but this one's really cute becomes, because it comes with a bunch of stickers, so yeah, but that is it for this video. Sorry if hauls aren't really trendy anymore, if they're more annoying and it's coming off as bragging. I swear I'm not. I'm just excited and to be back and make videos and my makeup was just 10 out of 10 and I wanted to film something, so yeah, but make sure to like and comment and do whatever down below and I will see you guys soon. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.